The first step in making a movie is writing a screenplay. So today we sit down with some of the writers of The Mulligan. It started with uh, you know, Ken Blanchard, Molly Armstrong created this uh, book, <clears throat> The Mulligan, uh, you know, kind of a parable of second chances. We see Paul in a place in life that um, he maybe never thought he'd be in, right? Uh, not, not the best place, uh, right? He's, he's so focused on work that he's lost sight of what's important. Um, and he's there at the tournament with one agenda, which is to meet Chow Wong as a, you know, and make a business connection. We adopted it from the initial book uh, where it was really the old pro talking with Paul and really kind of taking him through this journey and uh, expanded on, on those characters. And it's a story of him finding out that he can have mulligans in his own life with his wife and with his son. And it's, uh, it's a redemptive story. You know, I think God puts people in uh, other people's lives at the right time in the right place to help their transformation. Um, and, and I know that's true for me. The thing about people that have been in my life and, and many who are walking with the Lord could say, you know what, someone came into my life that I didn't expect on how they got there. I know God put them there and that's how, that's how I changed, right? So Chow is one of those people that um, through happenstance or providence, right, he's there uh, and Paul's trying to get that business connection, but Chow is a man of faith that helps uh, Paul uh, come fr you know, from a place of um, you know, brokenness to a place of wholeness uh, through you know, building a new relationship that would be part of the next act of his life.